Serval, it really is you. Wait, Japard, listen to me. When the sentry reported to me, I thought there must have been a misunderstanding. The enemy alarm had to be unrelated to your entry into the restricted zone. Perhaps the intruders had taken you hostage. And yet... Step away from the intruders, Serval. Walk over slowly and stand behind me. You're different from them. I'm sorry. We have an understanding. I stand with them. <sighs> Give me a few minutes, just a few. I'll explain every... Enough, Serval. <sighs> have you forgotten where we are? We Landau's ought to know this place better than anywhere. The outer reaches of the front line against the Fragmentum. Bellabog's most strategic protective fortress. Every Silver Main guard here, every person here, is ready to sacrifice themselves, ready to spill their blood for Bellabog at a moment's notice. Yet here you are, leading fugitives into the restricted zone, attacking my Silver Main comrades in arms, hijacking the energy hub. Are you really worthy of the Landau name? Why do you think I've come here? We've found a way to dispel the Eternal Freeze, to seal the Fragmentum. It might be the only lifeline this world has left. If that were true, why wouldn't you report to Madame Kokolia? Why would you sneak into the Restricted Zone and create chaos? You don't understand. The one preventing us from getting close to the truth is Kokolia herself. <sighs> you have all seen the Supreme Guardian in person. Do you think you can act as you please because she didn't recognize your version of events? Listen to me, Chapard. The origin and spread of the Fragmentum is linked to the Stellaron. The meteorite in the Architect's records, it's... I know about the Stellaron. It's exactly what the fugitives behind you are seeking. But the Madam Guardian has already revealed the truth to me. These people have ulterior motives, Serval. They want to steal this treasure from the Architect's. The Madam Guardian has warned me before that you were indulging in fantasy, that you'd been exposed to forbidden knowledge, and that you would bring destruction down upon Bellabog. I believe you, Serval. I believe you think you're acting with loyalty to the people. It's just... Guards, formation, arrest these people. We could be inundated with Fragmentum monsters at any moment. We have no time to waste on them. The forbidden is only forbidden to conceal the truth within. Kokoli is afraid that we'll seize on this knowledge, that the truth will spread far and wide. To save the world, we must risk it all. I've said my piece. Whether you believe it or not is up to you. Regardless, you should know by now your sister's never been one to back down. If there's something or someone you can't abide, you should stand up and resist. And if there's something you uphold, you should uphold it to the very end! Save your explanation for the judge. You are charged with sabotaging the Silver Main Guard Restricted Zone. In my capacity as captain, I hereby order that these fugitives be arrested! This isn't like our childhood game, Serval. You won't get any leniency from me. The barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero, Jepard! Uh, didn't I tell you? All our negotiations end in combat! <sighs> Great. Rules are made to be broken. Position is solid. Keep up. My tempo. Let's go. 
Ready to lose yourself? Fight it or rock with it. My music conquers all. Let's make it quick. Batter up. Hey, uh. Don't mess with me. I'll end your misery. For Just a scratch. Turn it up. Let's go. Yeah. Need a doctor? <sighs> Ready to jam. Who's next? This ends here. <laughs> What's in your prescription? Thanks. Keep up. This is our chance. What a headache. Let me tend your wounds. Stubborn as I am. It could be an argument or a fight. He'll do both to the death. That's why he bugs the heck out of me. That's enough, Jepard. Take a look around you. You're the last man standing. Even if I am, I won't yield. We don't want you to yield through force of arms. That wouldn't be a victory for us. Yeah, our goal is the same as yours, Sir Balls and Branya's. We just want to preserve this world. There's no reason to turn against each other. Japard, brother, surely now you can see the need for pragmatism. Even if you don't believe my outsider friends, you should believe me. Maybe I've wasted your trust. In which case, believe Branya. Lady Bronya. <sighs> There's nothing more to say, Jepard. The decision is yours. As a captain of the Silver Mane Guards, I am duty bound to carry out the orders of the Supreme Guardian. But, Lady Bronya is the commanding officer for the front lines. According to military protocol, if the front line directives of the commanding officer clash with those of the architects behind the lines, a soldier must remain at their post and await further directives. For the Silvermane Guards, the Guardian's orders are paramount and absolute. But there is something of equal importance in the oath we take. 
The people of Belabog. If we lose the people, we lose the reason for our existence. Our fight with the Fragmentum Monsters is for the sake of preservation. But our fight with you? I fail to see the purpose. If you are truly able to prevent our endlessly unfolding misfortunes, then the people of Belabog are indebted to you. But if you are using lies to mask your true intentions, using my sister and Branya for your own ends, I swear by Klepoth that I will carry out your punishment without an ounce of mercy. They're not lying, I promise you. You must be Zila. You are a skilled fighter. Your combat style is nothing like that of the guards. Regardless of what you believe, these guys have been a great help to the Underworld. Many people would vouch for them. Hmm. I'm sure. If you want to advance further northward, you must traverse an area entirely corroded by the Fragmentum. It's the only way to get to the Snow Plains on the other side. The guards can give you some time before the next wave of attacks is upon us. As soon as the restricted zone gate is open, the monsters on the other side will turn out in full force. The guards will do their best to stall them and buy you some time. Once you've broken through the front line, there's nothing more we can do for you. You'll have to find out for yourselves what lies within the Northern Fragmentum. So, have you made up your minds? Understood. Keep your weapons close. This will be a fierce fight. Guards, open the gate. Are you dealing with attacks like this every day? It's a common occurrence. Guards, formation. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna make sure I don't owe the guards any favors when this is done. Here they come. Steal yourselves. <laughs> the song's for you. Ready to lose yourself? You can fight it or rock with it. Let's make it quick. <laughs> Time to show you what's in your prescription. Your chain disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Let's go. Thanks. Pretty good crowd today. <laughs> Let's make it quick. Yeah. Let me tell your wounds. Mess with me. Who's next? Rules are made to be broken. So you are afraid of me. I'll end your misery. Let's rock. Let's go. You don't look so good. What a headache. Who's next? How many of them are there? The more the merrier. These guys are nothing. Hold the line. I'll free you from your 
chains disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. The barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero. This is only the first wave. They'll have reassembled soon. I have to. Hey, Mr. Silvermane, listen to your sister. I can tell just by looking at you that you haven't fully recovered. <sighs> Outsiders, Zila, the second wave hasn't started yet. Make the most of this opportunity and make a break for it. My brother can't hold them back by himself. He wasted a lot of energy on us. He's my responsibility now. Besides, if I'm not here to help, I don't know what might happen in the next wave. I want to go with you. I do. I always wanted to catch a glimpse of the Stellaron with my own eyes, and now it's so close. But I can't abandon my brother and the other guards. I'm a Landau. It's up to you now. I believe in you. You've given me new hope. Get hold of the Stellaron before Kakolia realizes what's happening. Hey, March. Don't forget to take a picture of the Stellaron for me. Say no more! We're good at this! Don't worry! Fragmentum activity is intensifying. Something's happening on Eurelo 6. Shouldn't we go down there, Himiko? <laughs> Have faith in them. Besides, this is her first trailblazing expedition. How will she be able to look back fondly without a few twists and turns? Are you bored, Welt? I understand. But we have lots of opportunities ahead of us. Let's leave the memories of this expedition for them. So you think they'll be safe, right? Yes. We haven't seen any Eon or Emanator-level imaginary reactions. Relax. This is a young person's adventure. We shouldn't interfere. At most, we could offer a little... off-site assistance. Is this... the Fragmentum Japard was talking about? Compared to this... The corrosion we saw in Backwater Pass pales into insignificance. Serval said that the Stellaron was very likely hidden in the snow plains north of Bellabog. If we want to get there, I'm afraid we'll have to find the exit to this Fragmentum maze first. Guys, does this place feel weird to you? It feels like... like there are loads of eyes staring at us. This place makes my flesh crawl. Like there are insects under my skin. We have no guide and no way of detecting the Stellaron. We'll just have to advance gradually and cautiously. Don't be disheartened. The stronger the fragmentum contamination, the closer we are to the source. isn't them. It must be a kind of echo. 
some type of residual energy replicated by the Fragmentum. Which means they were definitely here, right? And it looks like they went that way. <laughs> Just in time. We had no idea which direction to take. Let's go. told me what this place is, Mother. Seven hundred years ago, this was Velabog's northern border, and the site of an ancient battle. Here is where Elisa Rand led the first Silvermane guards in resistance against the Legion. Now, it is nothing more than an abandoned corridor filled with the sounds of old world echoes. Don't let its fragmented appearance fool you, Branya. On the day the promise is fulfilled, these ruins will become the breeding ground of a new world. Oh, Mother, do you truly believe the Stellaron's promise? It summoned the blizzard beyond our walls and opened the door of the Fragmentum. It destroyed our civilization. It... And yet... The crime of our ancestors was their inability to embrace that destruction sooner. What? From the moment those intruders descended from beyond the sky, this world was handed a death sentence. But the Stellaron has reserved for us a thread of hope. There is a price to pay for new life, wiping away every decaying vestige of the old world, renouncing the meaningless and lingering struggle. This is the price the Stellaron demands. When the promise is fulfilled, Branya, no longer will we have to squander our lives. <laughs> This is a complex mechanism. How did they get past? <sighs> I knew this wouldn't be simple. Uh, wait! Wasn't there some big energy hub-looking thing back in that empty area? Well, let's go back and take a look. Maybe it's linked to this gate. <sighs> I can't say I like the idea of interacting with our surroundings. Especially this deep into the Fragmentum. However... Other way. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Huh. Even Don Hung the Sensible has his adventurous days. It worked, right? But the gate didn't move an inch. Are there other units around? Hmm. It's clear that whoever designed these mechanisms didn't want outsiders to get through too easily. Let's keep looking for the energy hub. Look! Over there! I think I can see the next unit! Oh, I see it too. Let's go! Stop! Ah! 
can fight it or rock with it. <laughs> Rules are made to be broken. The best is yet to come. Wow, good stuff. Huh. These targets will make for good. Seems like it. Strange. Fragmentum monsters would usually destroy man made objects. Did you hear that? This mechanism must be on now. Come on, let's find the next one. Where is the next mechanism? <sighs> There's no switch. I've never seen such a desolate place. At least in Rivet Town, you could tell that people used to live there.
Don't miss it. Yes! Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Let's rock. You can fight it. Or rock with it. Not bad. Bring him in! Who's next? Turn it up. Rules are made to be broken. I want to ask you a question. Do you still remember those dreams you mentioned to us? I know you're wide awake right now, but I need you to try. See if you can recall the voice you heard. Well? 
This is merely speculation, but perhaps the voice you heard is the Stellaron somehow conveying information to Kokolia, and the one in your body is resonating with the Stellaron on this world. Huh? You mean that Stellarons can communicate? I've never heard that before. Well, there's never been a human that could accommodate a Stellaron in their body. Then, aren't we walking straight into a trap? <sighs> yes. And Branya may well be the bait. Don Hung's speculations are usually right on the money. But even if we've guessed right, we can't go home now. <laughs> There's no way back anyway. At least Kokolia won't catch us off guard now. So what if it's an ambush? We're not about to lose now. I have to save Branya, beat Kokolia, and crush this Stellaron thing to dust. is yet to come. Done! It took some effort, but we finally cracked these mechanisms. We're one step closer to Branya. Yes. The fragmentum here seems to have made a special connection with Kokolia. 